Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Yeah. You're good? You're good? Or in my mother tongue, get cruel, eh? Yeah? Uh, Nigerians in the house, are you here? Shit, yeah. uh, daddy. Uh, this is, we're gonna have a good time tonight. We're gonna, home is, right? So we're talking about space, we're talking about conversations, we're talking about stories that has been gathered in the footage you're gonna watch actually with them. It's probably called Heart. She, she's interviewed 30 or so people. Talking about this thing of where is home? What, what is home? What does home mean to you? And it's really interesting watching these interviews and you see people pop up just going into some deep thought because it's when you get asked a question, then you actually think, oh, I never actually thought about that. But then when you do, you come out with all these, all these beautiful things. This place that robs you of simple comforts like your name so that it never again sounds like yours. You don't want to see your voices. Now he, he will never speak of it. What it's like to watch your wife love of your life, mother to your child, not once, not twice, but four times over, cry for the tent of a night, and you can do nothing. They shout, go home. <coughs> and you hear the echo in those words in each supermarket queue, before each job interview. In British towns or Oyster cars are no longer passports. Even the times you spark enough bravery in your gut to talk to that person you like so much. You want to say, my skin is an army, not here to bother you, your family or your existence. You want to say, my skin is like yours. Hide. Hide and seek identity in wardrobes full of hands and gowns and disappointment. Secrets lurk in bottom drawers, inappropriately slow whining on abandoned socks. <laughs> The traditions call for an answer to me. They can't put a finger on what moon calls me home, but what they miss, what slips between the flicker of candle fire is that it's the home that calls to the womb, not the reverse. So I call myself home. And let the dance created by embracing me connect all the pieces left lost. Lost between wanting to be invisible is what makes the volcano ash, but it escapes its own walls. The task was simply to, to interpret the poems and create works of art and, and this is what they created. The title of the play is called Ile Lawa. So that three, two, one, we're gonna do Ile, so I'm on it loud. So three, two, one, Ile, yes we go, Ile. I am excited. I am so sweet right now. You just think that we shoot out all over. Oh. So one, two, three. Ilelawa. Ilelawa means we are home. These people load themselves onto sinking boats and can we have a duty to feel sorry for them if they wash up alive on our shore? Details are being verified. We will be seen in short. Hello! The time! Home is an insult in your mouth. You make it sound like a waste Go home. What if I'm there already? When do I get to be everything that I am in the place that I choose? Mm. The place that I choose. I like that. I chose England. They haven't chosen you. <laughs> <laughs> 